What's going on guys, Ryan O'Toole back here again giving you guys another review. Today I'm going to be reviewing the new family friendly comedy, Playing With Fire, starring John Cena. Sorry about that. And also starring Keegan-Michael Key, John Leguizamo, Brianna Hildebrand, and Judy Greer. If you guys are new here, feel free to click that subscribe button and that bell notification icon for more reviews, reactions, rankings, and more movie content. This movie centers around a group of force firefighters led by John Cena, Keegan-Michael Key, John Leguizamo, and they face their ultimate match when they have to take care of these three kids. They're stuck in a burning log cabin and now John Cena and them are stuck together and John Cena has to take care of them until their parents are back. And so we have a comedy. The trailer has premiered at pretty much every, pretty much almost every movie I've seen. And John Cena, when he does a movie like this, it just seems like it's for kids. But he has proven he can be in pretty funny comedies like Blockers, Bumblebee, etc, etc. I can say this movie overall was exactly what I was expecting it to be. It's marketed what it's marketed as. It is a Nickelodeon kids movie. There are a bunch of kids in my show and the kids were laughing out loud and the adults as well. So this is definitely a film for the family overall. But is it a great movie? It's definitely not. There is definitely a lot of issues with the film. But it's not like atrocious. There are some things I did enjoy. Cass is fine in the movie. John Cena, Keegan, Michael Key. Judy Greer, they're pretty much playing their basic personalities of what they are in real life. John Cena plays this tough, gritty guy who doesn't cry at all, and he takes his job really seriously as a force firefighter, but once these kids come along, it brings the fun, humanity, human side to him. There are some things with him and that he doesn't smile much, but once these kids come along, they force him to smile. John Leguizamo adds some funny parts, but not funny parts overall. But my favorite part was Keegan-Michael Key, because Keegan-Michael Key is great in everything. He is a freaking hilarious dude. Like, most of his jokes in the movie were really funny. I do like Brianna Hildebrand. She plays Negasonic Teenage Warhead in Deadpool. And she plays the older sister. She had some funny moments as well. Some funny parts in this movie that were in the trailers. So that's probably an issue is that some of the funny jokes were in the trailers. But they do add some fun parts to it. I did enjoy some of the family messages in the movie overall. It has been done to death before. I didn't really hate it. But I do enjoy that the movie has some interesting themes in there about foster care and all that. As far as issues with the movie, it does have a lot of forced comedy in it in that it has a lot of things in it that are more for the kids and I didn't enjoy as much as an adult. It's not a great movie overall. I can say if you enjoy John Cena and you enjoy family comedies overall that are for adults and kids, check this one out. But if you are a reviewer for film, you definitely don't have to rush to see this movie. It's not the best movie overall, but I had some chuckles. On my rating scale, I'm going to give Playing With Fire a 2 out of 5 stars. Alright guys, that was my thoughts on Playing With Fire. What did you guys think of Playing With Fire if you've seen it? Did you love it, think it was okay, or did you absolutely hate it? Let's talk about it down below in the comments. Thank you guys as always for watching this review. All my social media links are in the description below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.